Welcome everyone to another Super Dragon Ball Z on the PlayStation 2. And we're going to take on Ultimate Gohan in arcade mode. So we'll see how far we could get through the whole entire series or the whole entire arcade. But let us go through and fight Android 16 yet again. I think this also happened with Teen Gohan. Hopefully I'm correct about that, but let us fight Android 16. You won't win this. Now the one thing different a little bit about Gohan here is that he kind of has the same moves as Trunks a little bit. Just a little different, just a little bit, not too much. I mean, he still has everything kind of similar like Trunks basically. I don't know, they kind of like copy just Trunks' moves into Ultimate Gohan since he has the, the Z Sword. But he has this, uh, like charge attack type of deal. Like that. It's like a counter, well, he, Gohan says a counter strike, but it's like a teleportation, like punch attack. I guess it resembles when he fights, uh, when he fights Super Boo, at least. That's why I'm thinking what he's doing right now. But nothing. There's nothing good about him yet. Hopefully, like, once we, you know, get more points and try to level him up, I want to see what kind of other stuff does he have in his arsenal. Oh! But he's not bad of a character. He's okay, but it's just a complete clone of Trunks, basically. Did you really think you could beat me? And then also you could switch as well his sword. You could switch between his sword. I think you had to do up down to switch his sword. I'm not sure what is the difference, but I know it has to do with just the range of the sword mostly. So right now, I know he does not use his regular sword, the, the silver Z sword, so we have to change him. Well, I'll show you right now, guys. But not bad, nighttime. I think we never had a nighttime before. But there we go, we switch it and... The only thing different about this sword is that it has more range. I think this is sacrifices attack. Like in most cases, or just like Trunks when he uses his uh, the electric sword or the laser sword that you could get from leveling him up. Yeah, I was able to get him right there. Oh, oh the frame rate. But I think it's gonna be a little bit easier with Gohan. Not that he's. The easiest character to learn, but he has a long range sword, he has the same with his trunks. It's pretty powerful too, since he has a lot of attack. But we'll just have to see. There we go. Oh! There we go. Oh, nice, I got him with that. But yeah, I wish I could do more damage as well. But it's too bad that a lot of, that a lot of the attacks... And he does not have... Oh, he does have a time blast. Ah, oh, trying to get the grab. There we go. There's... Do this punch, yeah, he kind of has that hit punch that he does to Super Bowl. But I think that's pretty much it. He does have like a stab upward attack, so I guess you could catch people off if they do a Dragon Rush. But I don't don't use it right now, so hopefully like later on once I fight other people. Well, hopefully Vegeta, since he always jumps around a lot, we'll see if we could catch him with 
the point of our sword. But yeah, I think Gohan is not one of the characters I play a lot in this version of the game because it's just the sword didn't like that. There you go. We could stab him up there if we want to. You know what? Let me switch. There we go. Oh, he has a stupid counter too. No, <sighs> just because I hit my attack. Yep, this is gonna be a problem with Vegeta since, for whatever reason, he does more damage than I do. Wow. No, you're not. Oh, nice, he dashed into that. There we go. But how come he does so much damage with his damn key blast? It's crazy. Oh, he tried to counter, I see. Oh, I could have got him right there. That should, yeah. Well, I think he didn't block. I thought it was gonna, gonna be chip damage. But we have the range of the sword, so we should be alright. Of course, he'll just jump in front of me. Uh. Just stop. Stop already, Vegeta. Yep, I cannot. Nope. Come on, I was not even in the ground yet. There we go. Stab him again, stab him again. Do it again. No. Oh, okay, I can at least block that, that's good. Oh, uh, I wish I could have connected. Oh, there we go. Nice. Ah, uh, it's always Vegeta. Come back after you train some more. Yeah, it's always Vegeta that, for whatever reason, he has so much damage on just all of his attacks. It's stupid. All right, finally, we. I, I think Gohan might be the first one where I don't die from Vegeta, but we'll see later on because. It is arcade mode, so it could be a lot of cheap stuff in all of these games. Mostly just arcade versions. Alright, no more Mr. Mask. Alright, Piccolo. Oh, he almost tried to catch me right there. Yeah, I'm not sure what is the difference between that sword and the and the and the original C sword. Not sure what's the difference. Or like what could be what's more powerful basically. Ah, oh, you got me with that nice. Ah, oh, he did travel with it. Oh, nice. I got him from the back. Oh, you can't believe that spaceship. Damn, okay. Damn, okay. Has stab you. Oh, so he has an extra gauge, or does he have that many actions? I don't quite recall. Oh, 
Yeah, they just love to keep their distance. I mean, come on, Piccolo. Oh, you, well, that didn't do too much damage. Oh, who was that? What the hell? <laughs> Just like a Superman guy, I don't know. Ah, oh, just because I Dragon Dash. No, oh, he got me. Wow, nice. I'll give him that. <clears throat> Final round. Fight. Okay. Very nice. Yeah, I don't know why I don't. Hmm. I do need to test out like the differences between, you know, my attack and or the customization attack versus the default to see which one's more better or if they're exactly the same. Oh, that's not gonna hit. And that's not gonna chip. Nice. Gotta love that overhead attack. Well, you can still block it, but it is a good thing that it bounces, bounces, it, bounce him off. Sorry, because I would say bounces, it, but it doesn't really make sense. <laughs> oh, just hit it in the moment. So we got Trunks and Platinamic. Interesting. <clears throat> so I gotta fight the real version of this whole entire Let's sword go. battle. <clears throat> Round one. Fight! Get that there we go. Oh, nice. Okay, I could cancel into that. That's pretty good. Yeah, if you press square twice, and you do down back DP, which is a slash attack, you could cancel into it like that. Oh, your true power. I'm ultimate. You're not a Super Saiyan. I still won. Stab you? I don't know, it's still a pretty fun game that you could do combos like this. But since you're using PlayStation 2 controller, it feels a little bit... Not precise, I guess you could say that. I mean, I think it's just the controller problem. Because I think it would be awesome if I could use like a five stick to see what is the difference or how it feels to play with a five stick. Oh! Sorry, Trunks, but you cannot block, you cannot run, so you're done for. Guess that's it. <clears throat> but yeah, I gotta, I gotta love the range on the sword, at least. That's pretty good. So we have two more, two more to go, hopefully. Yeah, and if we fought Frieza, of course it's always gonna be Frieza. But I do wonder who's going to be the last one. I think it's still going to be Cell. It would be better if we fought Majin Buu, but for whatever reason, we still have not fought him. I think he's only in the the survival mode only. Round one. But whatever, Frieza, we're here to destroy him. Oh, that's so <clears throat> Sorry about if I'm like... It sounds like I'm under the weather. Not really. It's just... It is getting cold, so hopefully I don't get sick at some point.
But I just gotta be careful because sometimes I could just get sick from a family member or someone. And oh boy. Oh, that instant transmission, nice. What? He did that much damage? Okay, there we go. I think that also, well, gives him a buff, but I'm not sure if it, if it gave Frieza a buff to increase his health. Oh. Oh, come on, he like dashed back. Damn, he's a little bit more faster. Oh, come on. Wow. Well, for sure I'm not gonna win. <gasps> no, he... Tech that. Oh, no. There we go. Nice. Because I was thinking, wait, I cannot do... I could have done a combo into it, but I have a feeling I was not gonna make it. And I'm surprised he teched that. But I guess since he already got hit by the wall. So we have the cell game. So we have not lost a round, so I'm not sure... Yeah, it could give us like a bonus or something, because that's what arcade version games do most of the time. If you don't... We don't lose a match, or I think lose a round too, but that depends on the qualifications. Alright. Yeah, Cell is gonna, gonna definitely block all of those every time. Oh, oh come on. There we go. That's what I need. Another grab, please. I pressed the X button. Oh my god. There we go. Very nice. Nice. Love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. Round two. Fight. There we go. Oh, I was trying to do my super. There we go. Huh. Oh, hi. This. Well, technically I blew up a tank, but... Should be the end of Cell. There we go, a four stab. Nice. Did you really think you could beat me? So yeah, we did not lose a round, or we did lose a round, but we never lost a match. So... That was a good one, you know. Gohan's pretty good. Oh well, game over. Well, there you go guys, we Super did finish with Gohan. We did not lost our a match at least, but you know, it's too bad that we don't get anything else. But I think, like I said before, we probably need to change the difficulty in order for us to maybe get a different ending or something different at least. But right now, let's go summon Shenron see what kind of wish we could get next. Come Shenron, grant my wish. What is your wish? You will have only one. 
Okay, I'm gonna try the enhanced wish. We oh, already got everyone except these two. Set the narration to Vegeta. I mean, I could do that. Go to the world of the Kais. We do need that. You know what? Let's get it. Let's. Well, this is a special requirement for this witch. So let's get King Kai's plan. Why not? There we go, we got King Kai's planet. It's not available. Yes, yeah, farewell, Shimron. So let me just go to training. And I'll show you guys the map and we'll call it for today. Doesn't matter who we choose. Ah, oh, no, but this is training. I'm sorry. I forgot that training is you're in the hyperbolic time chamber. I mean, time chamber, sorry, the the time capsule. <laughs> I keep forgetting that those two are like different. But I guess I'm so more used to. I'm so more used to with hyperbolic time chamber. But I think that's. I think I said it wrong too. Since I do have another controller. And for whatever reason, it's not letting me plug it in. Hold on. Okay, there we go. So let's go to King Kai's planet. Because I just, just want to see like how everything is, how it looks. Not bad at all. I wish we could fight in King Kai's planet in the other Dragon Ball Z games, but we never do. And it's too bad that there's a timer, but let's see if we move on forward. That's pretty cool that you could go all the way around. And there's a chair. I don't know, it's so cool that you could have like this kind of, you know, like motion all the way around of King Kai's planet, but it's too bad that you know, why doesn't the other Dragon Ball Z games have this? <laughs> it could be fun, or at least in Dragon Ball Fighters. I mean, if you could have King Kai's plan, just make it like 2D. It doesn't need to be a full 3D environment. But yeah, there you go, guys. That's King Kai's planet. You know, we could go all the way around, which is pretty cool, but that's going to take a lot of time just to see where else we could go, but it's just a big giant circle. A big giant circle. I think we are able to fight in King Kai's planet from now on since we unlocked it. And yeah, we could go like right there in the the street itself. King Kai's <laughs> King Kai's car. Let's see. Yeah, and look at that, it's King Kai. King Kai was in the car. <laughs> Oh, that poor man. Let's see. You want know, let's try it again. Try it again one more time. Uh, I think we blew it up by accident. No, yeah, I think we blew it up by accident. But let, let us go all around, just in case. But I think since we blew it up, it's not going to come back anymore. Because I think that's how the game works. But this is not bad. I really like this. You know, this is like one of the planets that we don't get very much for map. For whatever reason, I guess. How can you make a map that is 2D but the whole thing is 3D, you know? I mean, they did it with the other maps of Dragon Ball. I mean, most of those maps are... Even though it has a flat floor, this could be a flat floor. I mean, it's not that hard. No, yeah, I, I think that's pretty much it. I mean, I think since we destroyed, we cannot do nothing much, so... Yeah, guys, that's pretty much it for today. And of course, next time we are going to go ahead and do Z Survival on Ultimate Gohan. So stay tuned for that. So make sure to subscribe to my channel for more Super Dragon Ball Z on the PlayStation 2. As well, follow me and go to Twitter for updates and Twitch while I live stream. Keep on playing and game for life, guys. See you later.